quick look here. Got a nice motor court, room for many cars, two car garage here, and then a single. Great sense of arrival in this home. Yard looks great. Really sets up nicely as a compound. When that gate closes, it's just you. Yard is mature. Well done. All right, here we are. Walking right into the living area. And then we can get straight to the best part. The family that owns this gets a lot of, lot of use out of the outdoor space. It's got a screen enclosure. It just takes care of pine needles and whatnot. A lot of nice seating area and whatnot. We're gonna take a little walk out to the to the dock. Let's check it out. I've got a single boat slip. You could add a boat slip, I'm pretty sure. And then one thing that they've incorporated is a lot of sitting space out here. So you can walk around this boat this way. They've got it set up for a pontoon boat with a lift. Just sitting area. Could have a fire pit there. What a day. Let's take a look. Peaceful and quiet. power and water. You have a fish cleaning station if that was your thing. A lot of people in the bay, they love the fish. They love the paddle board. They love the boat. Right here, head toward Crab Island. Established, looks great, really easy on the eyes. We're gonna come back through and look at that summer kitchen, or you know, we can do that now. Here we are. Got a green egg. Fantastic. Storage underneath that. Warmers, sinks, lots of storage, trash and whatnot. Very nice. Here, Got an outlet in the corner. Not important. Probably not. Huh, you gotta love it. <laughs> you gotta love it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get into, head straight to the master. All right, we're wide angle. So you can access the master this way. Let's just do that. So ceiling heights are just less than 12 feet. The rooms in this house are generous in size. A lot of natural light. Great bay view from the master. We've got closets. That's one. But let's check out this bathroom. So we've got double vanities, dressing area, soaker tub, shower. Great closet space. Now 
And when you came in, we just went straight. So they've got dining set up here. A trade lighting, great place for art. Now this is really one of the bedrooms. You know what, this isn't. This is really set up as an office and it, it does not qualify for a bedroom because it really doesn't have a closet. Although you could get one, but we're not gonna count it. And there's a half bath here to service that so you don't have too far to go. That's right. And uh, I've already checked out the master. It's gonna be on the west side of the house. Um, here we are with laundry, laundry sink, plenty of storage here. You know, you start opening up closets, you never know what you're going to get into, but knowing these folks a long time and really organized and keep things dialed in. Um, <laughs> you see our guy out there. He's awesome. There's that three car garage. We've got a German shepherd. We're going to stay out of the garage. Just seems like uh, the right call. So nice island. Microwave, dishwasher, double sink, undermounted. We've got a Thermador 36 inch range with hood. Got a lot of counter space, ample um, cabinets. And then let's see if we can and then you just got that bay view everywhere in the house. Everything's open. Um, and then really they've got a pantry set up, which as you can see, they, uh, they get a lot of use out of. Okay, so we're gonna just keep, keep moving. So we've got another bedroom here. And it's set up traditional. On sweet bath. And then dressing area. So we're gonna keep moving. Now this is really something that they've used as a gym. So it's got its own closet. Uh, they've had a sauna here over time, but I don't think they have that anymore. Full bath. You could do Peloton, treadmill. You could set it up for sleeping. I don't know that you would need it, but it just depends on who buys it. And they get a lot of use out of this space right here. Great views. And then all open. You can see this entire concept opens out into that living, into the kitchen. Just uh, the right way to do it. And then here we are into another living space. This is where they entertain, they watch sports games. They do really anything and everything right here. And this, this room gets, as a common area, aside from the kitchen, more use out of than any other, any other space. Real generous in size, really well equipped with technology, storage and books, that type of thing. And, uh, and then they've got a little powder right off of this space, which is helpful. Just really fluid and then access out to the pool from here and then back outside. So as we pan over to the left, one thing that they've also got is um, some area for wine, storage through that little door area and then uh, Good place for a million bucks right there in that safe. Okay, and so still on the first floor, and I think that's one of the things that makes a lot of sense with this house is you got horizontal living. So we'll go upstairs. We've got a great size closet. And then let's look at this bathroom. Let's check this out. So you've got a soaker tub here.
shower, water closet. I'm not gonna make a big deal about that. So more than ample space here. And then we're gonna head right on upstairs. Now this we'll call headquarters. So um, husband works at home and this is set up as an office. Originally this was designed for really an upstairs, could be a master suite, absolutely a master suite. Great views of the bay, looking down on the pool, TV, sitting, tremendous space here. Great space. God loves birds of paradise. And whatever you do, you don't try. You do it. Try is a limiting word, isn't it? Separate sitting areas throughout this upstairs. We've got two vanities, its own water closet, soaker tub. Fantastic closet up here. And we are just dialed in. They look good. He says, I want to be able to close the door, turn out the light, and be able to get dressed in my closet without even seeing what I'm putting on, knowing exactly what I'm putting on. Now, that's what we're talking about here. So there's order here. House has been taken care of to a T. Done a great job maintaining this house. And you've seen it. Again, let's walk out and look at the view one last time. They grow herbs right here. You can see some of the rosemary. We've got thyme, mint, beautiful palm tree out here. Just fantastic. Thank you so much. If you want to see more of these videos, see more properties before they come on the market, as they come on the market. In some cases, when they sell, smash that like button, subscribe button, and hit that bell icon. You'll be notified as soon as new videos come online. I appreciate you taking the time and watching this to the end. This is Blake Marar with Scenic Sotheby's International Realty. Thank you for your time.